In this video, I'm going to go over a couple of things that you will most likely do as a system administrator concerning metadata. The first thing I'm going to cover is uploading an RPD file using the command line. The second thing is uploading the sample app light bar file that comes by default with every install of 12C. Let's get started. First, I'm going to open the administration tool in online mode to show you the current RPD that I have deployed. Note the objects in the presentation layer, the business model and mapping layer, and the physical layer. Now, I'm going to upload the sample app RPD, which resides on my desktop. I'm going to open command line and use the datamodel.cmd command located in Oracle Home, User Projects, Domains, BI, BI Tools, Bin. I need to type the upload RPD parameter, followed by the path with the full name and file extension of the RPD I want to upload. Also, I have to specify the service instance and the WebLogic username and the password. I also need to provide the RPD password when prompted after executing the command. Now, I'll open up the administration tool again in online mode and see that the sample app light RPD has been uploaded. Now, I'm going to walk through the process of uploading the sample app light bar file. For this demo, I'm not going to show the process of exporting a bar file because you would do this in the lab. I have done this myself so that I have a backup of my security, web catalog, and RPD for redeployment later. Before I do the import, I am going to navigate to Analytics to view the current state of my web catalog. I am going to log in using WebLogic so that I can be sure that I am viewing the entire catalog. Take note of the catalog structure and its contents. I'm also going to check the list of subject areas I have available for reporting. Note that I have my own development RPD deployed. After I have successfully uploaded the sample app like bar file, I will return to the web catalog and the subject area list to see the differences. First, I need to open WebLogic scripting tool in interactive mode. I can launch it by using the wlst.cmd command under the Oracle Home, Oracle Common, Common, Bin directory. Now that I have launched WLST, I need to use the import service instance command followed by the following parameters. The first parameter is going to be the service instance directory. The second is the service instance name. The third is the location of the sample app like bar file and the file name itself. The import process will take a few moments. After the import finishes successfully, I need to restart the services. I'm going to skip ahead in the video as the full stop and start will take several minutes. After all the services have been restarted, it's time to launch analytics 
and see what was changed. Note that the web catalog now contains the sample app like content. Also, the list of available subject areas has been changed due to the sample app light RPD being deployed. 